Hello everybody, I'm Annabella, a first year medical student from Ireland and welcome to this week's vlog. It's a very exciting week this week because I'm studying for my upcoming placement and I get my exam results. So if you want to watch that, hang on, it's near the end of the video but it is very much worth it. Okay, without further ado, here we go. break lunch. This is lunch on a budget because I'm not working. <laughs> Protein, nuts, salad, one euro, one euro. Ketchup because don't judge me, okay? This one was a bit of a spend and I didn't realize it was gonna be so expensive but I had to buy it. 3.85. It's like a tub of potato gratin which looks absolutely delicious and really, really unhealthy. results just came out literally as I stood into this lift so I'm gonna open them I'll open them in somewhere quiet I'm nervous how nice is this place I found an empty lecture hall one of the new ones on top of the library oh god I'm so nervous of course, this isn't gonna work. <clears throat> I am so nervous. Here we go. Anything. I did way better than I thought. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, I've got to call home. I'm so happy, I can't believe it. I don't know why, I got this crazy feeling that I was gonna fail something. But I literally didn't even get close to failing. What a good day. I was so, so stressed over these exams. You saw, if you did see my last video, you'd see like, I was so stressed, I really did think I was gonna fail. Definitely cardio, but I didn't fail. I didn't fail any of them. And how stressed I was for the OSCE, like how nervous I was sitting in the library beforehand. And that was the one I did the best in. Oh my God. All that stupid hard work that I did <laughs> paid off. And it's really good to see that it actually did pay off. It's worth it. I don't know if it was worth it. <laughs> it's worth it for how I feel now. During, while I was studying, it was like the worst time in my life. And after I did those exams, there was like a sense of relief because you'd done the exams, but I felt so bad after I sat those exams. And I didn't need to. 
because everything went great which is crazy for me to say like who would have thought i would be here after how much i struggled in the first semester and i thought i was struggling this semester but i mean the numbers don't lie i'm joking i'm just being cocky now because i've passed all my exams and i'm literally delighted but i've got to get back into study and i've got placement coming up on i'm going down to waterford on sunday um doing orthopedics and trauma placement so i've got to get back on that grind learn all my bones <laughs> learn all my abcs for trauma but yeah i'm so happy what a good start to the day well not really a good start it's 12 o'clock but i woke up at like eight in a sweat because i thought my results were out and then we got an email saying they're coming out at 12 so i've just been like nervous this whole day on the lewis i was like waiting for the email and then it literally came as i was standing in the lift like Okay, I'm gonna go study, but I'm buzzing. Goodbye. Finished studying for the day. That was a very, very long day. And now, on the way to my friend's house to feed their cats because they've got away for the week. I need some animal love to be honest. So I'm looking forward to it. Long day. Hello. <laughs> Hello. I'm back in a very familiar setting. I'm back in the office for today because I just could not be arsed taking the Lewis the whole way into college. So I've been doing my workout here. I do think I get more done when I go into college, but um, it's just like that 40 minute journey into the college and the library itself it takes a very long time. So I am here today and I've just finished my Anki cards for the last two days which i'm very happy with and i've done one lecture so i've got to do three more lectures and then i'm caught up um yeah just had lunch and we started me and alex started watching um the summer i got pretty which is giving like to all the boys i loved before plus a little bit of that tv show i don't know if you guys remember it awkward it was on mtv it's giving the same sort of vibe so i'm on episode two and then i have to drag myself away to get back to work but i'm not sure about it yet but i do know a lot of people really really like it so i'm gonna i'm gonna keep going and hopefully it grows on me so right now i'm doing two more i'm doing hematology hematology and then no hematology and then a musculoskeletal lecture Probably the Federal Triangle. Okay, I'll see you later. Goodbye. Um, in each session, um, but I'm hoping to um, kind of test our equipment and see if we're able to set up more than one for each session because I know that they're also a hot commodity um, every time we run the skills sessions, especially as we get closer to our internal skills. Mm -hmm. Good morning. Cheers. Another day of study. Woo. for the day it's been a long day because there was a lot of anatomy and as much as i love anatomy i hate learning all the insertions and like places that the muscle go into the bone i just it's so hard for me to learn unless i'm literally standing up and going okay this is the sartorius and i'm like moving my actual leg around oh this is abduction this is adduction like it's a lot so, but I finished all my Anki cards, which means I have like a bit of a high, so I'm going home to eat. And I'm tired. I'm watching the violent.
Oh. After that dramatic exit at the library, I forgot my coffee mug. Coffee mug secured. Time to leave. I think I look insane doing these calf raises and lunges but I'm telling you one of the worst parts about being a medical student and going over all these lectures is that it gets inside your head so I've just done a lecture about clots and now I'm gonna have to move around because I'm afraid of getting a clot lodged from blood cooling in my veins sue me luckily the library was completely empty but I'm looking around because I'm very paranoid that people will think I'm literally insane in the library I'm going to pick up my too good to go order from Tang. It's 17 minute walk away and I will show you what I got when I get back to the college. This is the bag in my hand for content. First thing. Ooh, two cinnamon buns. Soup. Hard to one hand, you know. Ooh, chickpea salad, hummus, leaves. And you say there can't be more for six euro. Okay, there is more for six euro. What's in this one? Ooh, double portion. It's more like veggie things and rice. Not bad for six euro. It's two little buns, they look so good. It just looks insane to be honest, I don't think it worked. Me and Steven are going as two completely different 80s vibes. Steven looks like he is not from the 80s, he's like he just bought an outfit from Top Shop. My, one of my good friends, Emma, makes these gorgeous cupcakes. Look at that. And you know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do the cupcake trick. Cupcake trick, cut off the bottom, flatten out the lotus, put it on top, and then you eat it just like a sandwich. <laughs> Not the Ferrari out the airport. <laughs> I'm in the library every single day. You've got it gotta appreciate the outfits that you wear when you're out in the library hence the gold hoops for literally a hike not the camo and the shorts please I'm wearing green i'm also going to wear controversial does this look ridiculous she's saying sun safe she's saying am i going to a festival no i'm going on a hike She's saying it's matching the socks and the shorts. 
she's saying this is really ugly and she's probably not gonna wear it so yeah i'm gonna go on the hike now i'm not gonna feel guilty about not studying i will but i'm gonna try and suppress it i can't think my hair didn't come out curly at all it's literally straighter than it's ever been look at that that is so straight it's so straight i feel like there's a curl am i just going insane or is there some sort of curl in my hair it's really not Okay, goodbye. Sunday morning. It's cloudy outside. It's cold. It's perfect weather for watching a movie. There's nothing I want to do less than study. But I know if I don't do this, I'm just going to have to make up this during the week my mom placement which i won't do and then i'll just be behind and feel terrible so i know if i just do a little bit now i will feel so much better but there's nothing i want to do less but alas i must study i'm just gonna probably do my anti cards because i had the break yesterday so It'll be fun. I'm just gonna do this and then I'm gonna be back in time for the Grand Prix, the Silver Sun Grand Prix, where Kyla started to study first. Respect. So that's what I'm gonna do now. Okay, gotta go. The quicker I start it, the quicker I finish it. Look at this 115 plus one. Valine is the point mutation in sickle cell anemia. Now, time for Formula One. Woo! Marlo, what are you doing? That's it for this week's vlog. If you've made it this far, thank you very much. I'm actually in the car on the way to my next placement in Waterford, which will be in Trauma and Orthopedic. So I'm gonna be there for the next two weeks. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed and come back next week to see how I get on in my first week in Waterford University Hospital. Okay, thank you so much for watching and please subscribe.